Good morning, hallelujah. I'm excited and I wanted to share my excitement with you. Hallelujah. Come Holy Spirit, Lord, I pray you speak. I feel the fire of God go through the fall in Jesus' name. Come Holy Spirit, Lord, I pray you speak it to me and speak through me and anoint these words that are coming out of my mouth. Glory to God. Man, yeah, I just wanted to share my excitement with you. So this Sunday is the day that we're doing, the Kingdom Leaders is doing the outreach in Balcomville. And, um, it's at 709 Smith Street, West Monroe. And we're setting up at a store. And the store is called Three T's. Three T's. Three with a T and apostrophe S. We'll be setting up there around 4 p.m. And we're going to be passing out plates of food with a drink. And then giving the care packages out. And then each care package will include a pack of toilet paper. Some shampoo. And then some of the shampoos are shampoo uh, plus conditioner, but we ran out. They ran out of all the shampoos plus conditioner, so we had to get regular shampoos, too. So, and then I bought a thing of deodorant and soap and a razor. So, we'll be giving all this stuff out for free, the food and the drinks. So, and I just want to encourage you to come be a part of what God is doing in Balcomville to come help serve and... Uh, we need hands to help us. We need some more hands. To come be the hands and feet of Jesus. If the Lord's leading you, man, we come, come. We invite you to come in Jesus' holla in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's going to be a good day. I'm expecting God to move mightily. We want to give them, meet a need, but also uh, give them Jesus. And the best way to give them Jesus is through an encounter with the Holy Spirit. Let them feel the presence of God, something they've probably never experienced before. And, um, yes, anyway, we're expecting a, a, a move of God. Hallelujah. I encourage you, come, come, come. We all have a blessed day full of love and peace. And know Jesus loves you so much, so much. And he wants a personal, that's a crazy looking cat. Different colors. It's colors I ain't never seen before. Jesus is after your heart, your whole heart. He wants a personal relationship with you. You know how we are, you know, friends. We, we got our friends. You know, we hang out with them. We have to spend time with them to get to know them. And you want to be around them. The well, Holy Spirit wants us to spend time with him to get to know him. And, and, and not just do all the talking, but give him the opportunity to talk to you too. Hallelujah. So last night, amen. So I was just spending my quiet time with the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. So I was just spending just quiet time alone with the Lord and how I was doing that. I was just laying on my bed. I didn't have no music. No, it was just silence. And I was like, here I am, Lord. I'm, I just want to hear you speaking, right? Just spending time with him. And this is what he told me. And this is not for just me. It's for the body of Christ. Amen. To stop worrying, to repent. We need to repent of worrying, to repent of worrying. When we, when we are worrying... We're not fully trusting God. We have to, whatever we have on our heart, you know, um, give God our cares because he cares for us. Just give it to God and trust him with it, that everything, whatever, that he's, he's going to be okay and not to worry about it. When we continue to worry about it, we're not trusting him. So he's calling us to repent of worry and trust him. Amen. Praise God. To repent of worry and trust him. So that was my little conversation with the Lord for that for that moment until I had to take Jade to, to CR last night. Hallelujah. Y'all have a blessed day and go in peace. And Jesus loves you.